Nice playing, Rory. Thank uh, you. Xander was just up here and said you made a lot of putts in like the four to eight feet range where you just kind of had to have them and you made them. Uh, is it gratifying to you to, to have everybody talking about that in addition to the driving? Yeah, um, both ends of the bag are working pretty well, and then the stuff in the middle is not too bad either. But, uh, yeah, I, I putted well all day. I felt uh, yesterday against Keegan, um, I, f I found something or I got a feel uh, and then putted really good this morning against Lucas and then continue that this afternoon. My speed was a little off uh, early on. I think just because the greens were drying out as the day went on, they just got a little bit faster. But um, you know, sort of once I figured that out and held a nice putt for two on four, got my eye in and saw one go in, then um, yeah, it was really good after that. So no nerves on the putt on 18? I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah, some nerves. Yeah. You know, it was a, you know, it's, I'm sort of, I feel like I get more nervous watching the other, my opponent play because you just don't know what they're going to do. You're, right. you're in, in no control of what they do, right? So at least with my stuff, I'm in control of it. So I sort of feel like I, I have not as many nerves, but yeah. Um, but yeah, it was, you know. I feel like I got lucky. I expected my ball to be Xander's ball on 18 behind that tree. And, um, you know, I got fortunate that I'm, mine trundled down the hill and obviously made the, the chip shot a lot easier. 18's been friendly to you today. You had a great chip on 18 in the morning. Yeah, it's been, um, yeah, it's sort of been friendly to me all week. So, um, yeah, and hopefully if I can play a little bit better, I don't need to play 18 tomorrow, but we shall see. I'm sure you want to win every time you tee it up, but is there anything special about this week being the last one? Yeah, I mean, I haven't really thought much about it, but, um, yeah, it's just, you know, match. I think winning the match play is always a massive accomplishment because of what you have to go through, right? You know, it's you know seven rounds, and, um, you know, especially this week, I feel like a lot of my matches have been really, really close, so to be able to sort of pull them out when I've needed to has, has been very gratifying, so... Um, yeah, maybe a, a higher sense of satisfaction when you you know get through on Sunday night and you're able to win. It's a um, I feel like maybe just more of a an achievement mentally to to do it rather than you know just winning a, a four round stroke play event. Um, Xander said on 18, his perception was that you thought his ball might be yours, and then when he walked by, he was kind of like, <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> is, that, um, is that true? Is that how? It yeah, was? yeah, yeah. I, I I was. Uh, Walking up there, expecting it to be a tailor-made ball, and I saw a Callaway on it, and I was as surprised as anyone because mine was further left than Xander's off yeah. the tee, and uh, yeah, like well, you know, you need a little bit of fortune in these things, and you know that was that was a bit of luck for me today. Uh, on 17, you switched from the wedge to the putter. Uh, it was sort of nervous watching you with the wedge. <laughs> what was your feeling? Why did you switch? Just wasn't quite a good enough lie to slide the bounce underneath the ball. Like I, I thought, like if I got it absolutely perfect, but the margin for error was so small yeah. that if it just bounced at all, it's you know 25 feet away. So I just felt, you know, a bad putt beats a bad chip there uh, every time. So that's why I switched to the putter. And Roy, I mean, I want to look ahead, but how hard is it to derail Scotty, who's won 10 matches in a row here? Yeah, um, I'm not even, you know, I've got a match before I, sure. you know, potentially get there. So I need to focus on either Cam or, or Kurt tomorrow. Yeah, but he's been Scotty. Oh, he's been unbelievable. Been, I mean, he's, yeah. you know, he's been so dominant since this time last year and, you know, what he's won and, you know, being number one in the world for, you know, a, you know quite a quite a big chunk of that time. He's super you know, I played the first two days with him with the players a couple of weeks ago, and just super impressive what he's doing. One more guy. Uh, last European in the ride or in the, in the race for the title here. Um, is that is there anything to take away from this week for the Ryder Cup later this year? Is there... No, I mean the major the majority the majority of um, of points for play at the Ryder Cup are the team elements, right? The four balls and the foursomes. So uh, I, I don't think you can look too much into it. Thanks, Thank you.